Hi, I'm Blake McGowan, and I'm a certified professional ergonomist with Human Tech. Awkward wrist postures are a known risk factor for musculoskeletal disorders such as carpal tunnel syndrome, especially sustained awkward wrist postures like when using a keyboard or a mouse. One of the likely mechanisms for carpal tunnel syndrome is elevated carpal tunnel pressure and the resulting swelling in that area. Now we know that people that are diagnosed with carpal tunnel syndrome have three times the carpal tunnel pressure compared to those uh, healthy individuals, even in a neutral posture. We also know that there's a strong link between postures in the wrist as well as carpal tunnel pressure. So in 2007, Peter Keir and David Rempel put together a really nice study trying to measure the carpal tunnel pressure in healthy individuals and try to figure out what is the wrist posture that elevates that carpal tunnel uh, pressure to the same level of those people with carpal tunnel syndrome. So what did they find? What did they find are the safe wrist postures? Well, for wrist extension, the safe posture is less than 30 degrees. Now for wrist flexion, it's less than 50 degrees. For radial deviation, it's less than 20. And for ulnar deviation, it's less than 15. So what does this mean? What's the bottom line? The bottom line is that we now have some very great guidelines based off physiology to help us understand how to reduce things like carpal tunnel syndrome. This is especially important in the office environment when we're using things like keyboards and mice for a sustained period of time. So it's really, really important to choose the right equipment, such as a keyboard or mouse, that minimizes those postures in order to reduce the likelihood of carpal tunnel syndrome. For more information on Human Tech and the Bottom Line series, please feel free to visit us at our website, humantech.com. Thanks. Have a great day.